Hi everyone, it's Rax. I have a quick update for you on Last Epoch and EHG 11th Hour Gaming is trying something pretty bold here that I'm actually very interested to hear what you think about. So they're doing the Imperial Uprising. It's going to launch on September 19th and go through October 20th, so it's going for a month. They're going to announce the full details on the 17th. But what you can expect is... It's going to work for, the Last Epoch is going to work for a Steam Deck. They're going to have new and updated shrines, quality of life improvements to dungeons, loot lizard encounters. I don't even know what this means. Is this like goblins? Stash tab priority system. Oh, okay. What could that mean? More for the bizarre search and month-long event modifiers. Now, the interesting thing about this event is they are actually resetting everything. It's a fresh start. The ladders are going to be reset. The economy is going to be completely new. It's going to level the playing field. So this is not the next season or the next league or the next cycle of Last Epoch. Just in the middle of it, they're just deciding to reset everything. So you might ask, well, uh, why are they doing that? Well, they said that it should be the game should be balanced by player skill and effort, but there was an exploit with gold that kind of ruined the economy. So they want to fix that. They have a bunch of quality of life things that they want to implement into the game sooner than later, which is what they talked about here as well. They have a ton of great suggestions that they want to act on. So I've actually don't think I've ever seen this before. I've seen Blizzard does mid-season events, but they never reset anything. And Path of Exile sometimes do, does separate little challenges like the Gauntlet, but they never actually reset what the actual characters are doing. But ESG is saying, no, we want to do the full reset on this event. And I, I don't know, I'm assuming this is going to be met with mixed emotions. Some people might really like the fresh restart. For me personally, if I was still playing Last Epoch and they said a month from now or a couple weeks from now, they're going to reset it in the middle of the season. I would be in favor of it because I play all the time and I don't care if you wipe my characters and it's just another really fun way to start over. That's the way that I enjoy ARPGs. But I'm 100% I'm sure that not everyone is going to agree with this. So I guess here's my question. If you don't agree with this, what do you think that they should do? Should they do it separately like PoE where this Imperial Uprising is like a second thing that you can log into for a fresh start for the end of the cycle? Would that be better? I don't know. Either way, I don't hate it. And I do like EHG and I do like Last Epoch. So it's kind of interesting. I'm glad that they're updating the game. And we'll tune in on the 17th to see exactly what we're going to get. And uh, we're even more excited for the next League 1.2 because the last Epoch League has or cycle has been out for a while now. So we should get some new info, I'm hoping soon. Thank you.